Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross Maths key skill video on calculating simple interest. And we have this problem here. I've saved £600 in a bank account offering 5% simple interest. How much will I have after 10 years? Now firstly just say that interest with a bank account is when the bank gives you a certain percentage of what you have on top of what you already have. So for example, if I put in a thousand pounds into a bank account and they gave me 5% interest each year, then that means I get 5% of that a thousand pounds, which is 50 pounds. So I will then have a thousand and fifty pounds after one year. Now there's two different types of interest, simple interest and compound interest. So simple interest is when the percentage is based on the original amount you have, whereas compound interest is where the percentage interest you get is based on the current amount. And what I mean by that is that that 5% you get is based on the original £600 that you put into the bank account. So when they give you that 5% interest after one year, you'll have a greater amount but then the subsequent year, they don't give you 5% of what you now have, as you would with compound interest. They just give you the 5% of that original £600 you put in. So all we need to do is to work out what 5% is of £600. So 5% of £600. Well, 1% of £600 is £6. So 5% would be £30. So that means we're going to get £30 interest per year. And because it's simple interest, it means we do indeed get £30 every year. That amount of interest we get each year is not going to increase. Now, it's asking how much will I have after 10 years? Well, each year they're giving us £30 interest. So we can do the 10 years times the 30 pounds, and that means in total, the bank is gonna give us 300 pounds over the 10 years. So then we just need to add that on to the 600 pounds, 600 pounds plus the 300 pounds, and that means I'm gonna have 900 pounds in total. And that is the final answer.